Uh, we started this quite a few years back for one of my really good customers. Uh, he kind of came to me and said, Kenny, he says, I want you to build whatever you want and I'll pay for it. Uh, so I started building it for him and he had ran into some health issues and unfortunately, uh, he's still with us, but unfortunately he decided he needed to sell the project. So it got put on the back burner, was put up above the office for a while. And then one of our other great customers, Kevin, uh, said, Kenny, man, I, I see and feel your passion for this, this project. Let me buy it and you can finish it the way you're going. So I'm really excited about this thing to get it done. Hopefully next year we'll have it done on the road. We built the full tube chassis for it. The center punt page has all been countersunk punch. It's got a real gnarly big block in it. What is super cool is that the Mike at Alki Digger, they've set us up with a uh, mechanical fuel injection, which is old school, which is just gonna be so cool to get out at the grocery store and you know pop the cover off this thing, pump some fuel in it, crank it, start it up and go. So really old school looking, uh, which is just gonna be way bitching. Um, something we've done with this thing, we've chopped it, it'll have suicide doors, I've got to build bunny car zoomies for it. What you see up front is what you're going to get with the exception of a headlight. Uh, the radiator and stuff will mount in the back, the fuel tank will mount in the back. Uh, we've done this rocker lay down coil over system on it. Um, we're not the inventors of it, but it's my design, what I wanted to do. So uh, we use a rack mounted on the uh, drop axle, which works really great. I mean, this thing just steers like butter. I mean, it's got a big block Chevy in it. It's just effortless to steer, so way cool. So in the back, we're not gonna run a bed on it because I want to see all this mechanical stuff working and going up and down. Uh, there'll be some 37 Ford tail lights down here. We will end up doing kind of a funny car cage on the inside. And there'll be two bars that come out and down. Radiator will mount here, and then the gas tank will free float right below here. Uh, but like I said, I want to see all this gnarly mechanical metal stuff going down the road. So super excited to get back on this thing with my guys here at KRS. Keep an eye on it. We will have it on the road next summer. Hey guys, we have these killer hats from High Desert Prints. Way cool, KRS hats, we're digging them. Um, our Project 40 Ford pickup, we don't have a name for it yet. So why don't you as the viewer send in this name for this thing and between the owner and us, we'll pick it and you'll win a free KRS hat. Thanks.